think we've played Texas Tech more than any other team on our schedule. It goes way back. There's so many people today that don't understand it, uh, and, and our own players, and I'm sure there's also just can't relate to the intenseness of the rivalry between the two teams. It was wild. Every play was so intense. You knew you were, were going to get another team's best shot every single time you played. The rivalry was brutal. The competition was brutal. They all played against each other in high school. So the rivalry started well before those players reached the collegiate level. The fan bases were so into it and so involved and so fanatical about beating each other, that all of that really created an environment when Texas and Texas Tech played, it was a happening. When I talk about those crowds, you know, from 12 to 15,000, 10, 12 years ago, it was almost unheard of um, in the game of women's college basketball, and that was just totally a credit uh, to Jody and her staffs and what uh, Marcia Sharp and her staff was able to do at Texas Tech. It was a respected rivalry. And when I say that, it's from the player perspective. I mean, they really, really loved playing against each other. It was a bloodbath, but then when it was over with, they were actually all friends. For many years, both Texas and Texas Tech were ranked really high in the national polls. So it made sense for us to play each other. It made sense for us to grow the sport. It made sense, even if you knew that there was gonna be a chance you might lose the game, you wanted to promote the game of basketball. Once you stepped on the floor, you just couldn't deny the level of talent that the players had and the want to for them to beat each other. There is always a feeling that uh, you have bragging rights when you beat Texas Tech, and I'm certain that they feel the same way about the University of Texas. We all bleed red if we're from Lubbock, we all bleed orange if we're from Austin, then there's going to be a competition when these two get together.